On July 20, 1974, Turkey launched the Cyprus peace operation to stop the Greek oppression and persecution of Turkish Cypriots, prevent the forced unification of the island with Greece, and establish peace there. Here is a look at what led to the Turkish military intervention on the island of Cyprus. For centuries, Greek Cypriots and Turkish Cypriots lived together harmoniously on the island. In the mid-1950s, the Greek terrorist group Ioka started a violent campaign against Turkish Cypriots as well as British soldiers, civil servants, and Greek Cypriots who were opposed to the goal of uniting with Greece. Systematic attacks on Turkish Cypriots by Ioka continued for years. On December 21, 1963, a night of mass violence later dubbed Bloody Christmas took place. 103 Turkish Cypriot villages were attacked and hundreds were killed. The bloody campaign also led to the displacement of 30,000 Turkish Cypriots who had to take shelter in an area constituting merely 3% of the island. In 1974, violence broke out amid a Greek Cypriot attempt to forcibly unite Cyprus with Greece following a coup staged by a right-wing military junta. İşte Rumlar kendi aralarında e, savaşı başlattılar. Sokağa çıkma yasağı e, ilan edildi. Sonradan Türklere yöneldiler. Türklerde olan küçük köyleri e, veya silahlarını, orada askeri birliklerini ne varsa onları himaye altına aldılar. Barış gücü kontrolünde bizim köyümüz teslim olmuştu, savaşmadı. Silahlarımız verildikten sonra birkaç gün sonra bizi tekrar yayılım ateşine tuttular. Yani elimizde silah var mı, karşılık verecek mi e, düşüncesiyle. Bu durumda karşılık e, verilmediği için onlar biraz daha rahatladı e, çünkü elimizde silah yok. Gelip buradaki e, olan erkeklerimizi yani yaşları 14 ile 50 arası olan, 50 silah tutacak olan gençlerimizi e, toplayıp okula götürdüler, Rum okuluna. Sonra esir kampına götürülecekler diye otobüslere bindirdiler. Bunları e, tamamen katlettiler. Turkey stepped in as a guarantor power in order to prevent the ethnic cleansing of Turkish Cypriots. The island has since been divided with a Turkish Cypriot government in the north and a Greek Cypriot administration in the south. The Turkish Republic of Northern Cyprus was founded in 1983. Turkey has been seeking a peaceful solution to the crisis through diplomacy. While the Turkish side supports a two-state solution based on equal sovereignty, the Greek side supports a solution based on the hegemony of the Greeks. 50 seneye yaklaşık bir zaman oyluyor. Kimse daha e, bunu kanamadan yaşantısını sürüyor. Türk askeri tabii ki kalmalı. Yani zaten e, Türk askerinin e, kalması en garantör o bizim için.